Pisces, early in the month, you might feel like you're on shaky ground, but by the end of the month, let me tell you, the tide will turn. First, we have a new moon on the 4th, and it will fall in your home and family sector. So, if you are thinking about initiating a new beginning connected to a move, real estate transaction, or even some new family development, it is a great time to move forward with those plans. However, this particular new moon is a little difficult. In fact, it's a lot difficult. So, whatever new beginning you're trying to push through with a family situation or a move, there will be obstacles. You'll have to be ready for them. There'll be obstacles that you feel like you can't really control. It might lead you to second guess your whole decision, but I don't want you to abandon whatever new plans you have related to family because it's a new moon. A new moon is a new moon. And you have every opportunity to plant those seeds of intention and they can be carried out. You just have a little extra swimming to do before you get to the end of your goal. On June 17th, we have a really confusing aspect. Saturn and Neptune will square off, and Saturn is in your career sector now, squaring off with Neptune in your sign. So it seems like your boss or an authority figure, someone above you, is just not getting you, not respecting you, not understanding you, and it's frustrating because you feel like you're invisible to this person, and you can't really move up the way you want to because you don't have an ability to get this person to really see what you're all about. Do your best to move past it because by the 20th, things really do change. A full moon on the 20th is happening in your career sector and it's a gorgeous full moon that suggests fulfillment in career is very possible. So stand true to your goals and just focus on the work. Focus on that and what you want to achieve and you're definitely going to have a reward in store. On June 26th, Jupiter and Pluto will be at a gorgeous alignment to each other. And with Jupiter in your partnership sector and Pluto in your 11th house, it looks like you and your mate are really benefiting from that shared dream that you are pursuing together. It's also a time of amazing social harmony and you might also benefit together from someone that you know in high places. So make sure that you're out and about around this time to benefit from that energy. Finally, on June 29th, Mars will turn direct after having been retrograde since April 17th. Mars goes direct in your ninth house, and so now, if you felt stalled with any international type of business, anything in the publishing, advertising, or broadcasting industry, it's going to move forward. And if you're in a legal case and you felt stuck as well, you're ready to fight again for what you believe in. So, Pisces, now that you know what's in store this June, be sure to check out more astrology videos right here at tarot.com.